In this chest x-ray, what is this and what is this anomaly called? Hello and welcome to the Air Anatomy channel. Today we will learn about the azygos lobe. What you see here and this anomaly is known as the azygos lobe anomaly. So what happens here is the azygos vein runs through the upper part of the lung carrying a mesoazygos with it demarcating the rest of the upper lobe from this part called the azygos lobe. Let me just make it clear by this series of animation. This is the lung. Around it, you have the visceral pleura adhered to it, which is outlined by the blue color. From the edge of this blue, you have the parietal pleura. On the outside of the parietal pleura, you have the azygos vein, which is located here developmentally. And usually, the azygos vein runs like this to be on the medial aspect of the lung. You remember that on the medial aspect of the lung, you have the impression of the azygos vein on the right lung. But instead of that, in the azygos lobe, what happens is the azygos vein goes in a different direction into the lung, carrying a layer of parietal and visceral pleura along with it. And this is now known as the mesoazygos. If you look carefully into this image, you can see that this is that azygos vein. And this thin line that follows upwards is called as the mesoazygos. And if you look carefully, in the uppermost part of that mesoazygos, you can see a triangular darker shadow. And as you know, the azygos vein is also having a darker shadow. So these two features will be seen on a plain chest x-ray as you see here. This is the azygos vein and this is known as the trigonum parietal or in other words, the parietal trigon. So these two are the features that you see in an azygos lobe. Please understand that this is the mesoazygos and medial to that you have the azygos lobe and this is the azygos vein which is running a variant course here. In an axial CT, let us have a look at how this azygos lobe will present. This is the right lung, this is the left lung. Always azygos will be present on the right side because we know that the azygos vein is present on the right side. So this structure is the if you look, go downwards, you can see the azygos vein here and you can see that the azygos vein is, is uh, entering into the superior vena cava by arching forwards anteriorly. And you are seeing how the medial aspect of the lung is present over here. This is the azygos lobe. And if you run uh, upwards, you can see the thin mesoazygos that is separating the medially running uh, azygos lobe from the rest of the upper lobe of the lung. Thank you.